We'll begin when you're ready, Detective. July has arrived, and so too has another fantastic Humble original title. This is 2001, A Space Felony, or How I Came to Value My Life and Murder Relentlessly, by National Insecurities. And from the title alone, you get a pretty good sense of what you're in for with this one. Space Odyssey spoofs and silliness. 2001 is a first-person narrative exploration game set aboard a space station where the aim is to investigate the murder of the onboard crew. You do this by floating through the station in zero-g, taking pictures of clues and examining crime scenes. You then present this evidence to the ship's AI to piece together exactly what happened. The game is presented in the form of a classic detective film, with you recounting your actions to a detective investigating the case, who narrates the game as you go along. Not only does this lead to some genuinely funny dialogue... Abort mission. I am sorry. The connection seems to be failing. Mal? I am... going through a tunnel. Return to Earth. But it also keeps the game flowing smoothly and stops you from getting caught up on details that are irrelevant to your progression. Another way a space felony keeps you progressing through the game is its clever use of visual indicators. The game has a nice, colourful, minimalist aesthetic that uses bright, stark colours to distinguish noteworthy elements from ordinary set dressing, and also subtly draws your attention towards important clues using similar visual techniques. It's a great example of intelligent game design that solves the problem that similar exploration games occasionally have, of feeling aimless and losing track of what to do. This exceptional visual design also heavily factors into the game's outstanding sense of cinematic style. Everything from the layout of the space station to the fantastic use of classic orchestral scores is designed to invoke a powerful sense of cinematic flair in the vein of Kubrick's Space Odyssey, and the developers absolutely nail it. I designed it. Here, I have the freedom of movement to perceive you from any angle. 2001 A Space Felony is not only a fantastic humble original title, but one of my favourite first-person exploration adventure games. It has good pacing, it's engaging, it runs well, it's funny, it looks great, it's actually fun to play, and it doesn't overstay its welcome with a tidy one and a half hour completion time. You can add this one to the growing list of humble originals that feel like well-made, full-price products. Hi everyone, thanks for watching the video. I just wanted to give a quick shout out to a new feature added to the Humble Monthly subscription, which is the Humble Trove. It's a bunch of games that subscribers can access, which includes all the Humble originals, as well as some cool indie titles like Dust Force and Volgar. If you've been watching my videos and missed out on any of the games I've talked about and want to go back and check them out, now you can. I think it's an awesome feature, and if you're looking for some recommendations, check out my end of 2016 wrap up video, or have a look through the video playlist below. Once again, thanks to everyone for your kind words and support, it's the best motivation to keep me making these videos, and if you want to see new humble original reviews as the games are released, please feel free to subscribe to the channel, I really appreciate that too. Thanks everyone, see you soon.